Today I'll show you a cool little smart hack to make Chamberlain and LiftMaster garage door openers work with smart things. Stay tuned. Welcome to Bud's Smart Home, where we provide tutorials and reviews for devices which work with smart things and Amazon Echo devices. Recently I purchased this Chamberlain B1381T smart garage door opener. This is a belt drive opener that is equipped with a battery backup. I'm extremely pleased with this purchase. The Chamberlain belt drive is much quieter compared to my former screw drive opener. When I purchased this opener, I was fully aware that Chamberlain and LiftMaster products are not supported by SmartThings. However, I was hopeful that I might be able to get it to work with SmartThings. But to my dismay, when I connected the Go Control relay to the Chamberlain opener, I discovered that it would not function as expected. Because I prefer to have all smart home devices controlled within my SmartThings app, I began looking for a possible workaround. After a little research, I stumbled across a video which demonstrated how to automate a garage door opener by wiring a smart relay direct to the circuit board within the garage door remote. So I decided to test this method by wiring my Go Control relay to my Chamberlain remote. Using this method, I now have the ability to control my Chamberlain opener within the SmartThings application. Now I'm satisfied with keeping my Go Control relay to automate my garage door. I've used this particular relay for five years and it has proven to be very reliable. But because this particular relay is now out of production, I decided to find a relay which I could recommend to anyone who might have interest in replicating this setup. So I purchased and began testing the Zeus Zen 16 multi-relay. I have found this relay to be as capable and reliable as my Go Control relay. If you want to automate your LiftMaster or your Chamberlain MyQ Control garage door opener within SmartThings, you'll need to purchase and pair a Zeus multi-relay with your AOTech or SmartThings hub. You'll also need to dedicate one of your Chamberlain garage door remotes to the project. I also recommend that you purchase a garage door tilt sensor. The tilt sensor is essential for automations. The sensor will permit you to see the open-close status of your garage door within the SmartThings app. You'll find all of these smart home products listed below this video. With your smart devices in hand, you'll then need to install a Zeus device handler within your SmartThings account. You'll find a complete guide on my website, Bud's Smart Home, with easy to follow instructions for installing the Zeus device handler. Setting up the Zeus multi-relay is as simple as pairing it with your SmartThings hub. Then you'll use standard bell wire to connect the relay to one of the circuit boards within your garage door remote. For MyQ controlled garage door openers like Chamberlain or LiftMaster, you simply connect the bell wire to the appropriate switch on the remote circuit board. If you have a different garage door opener that's not controlled by the MyQ app, Zeus provides instructional wiring diagrams so that you can direct wire the relay to your opener. When wiring is completed, you'll then power your Zeus relay using a standard USB-C to USB cable. The USB cable is provided by Zeus, but you'll need to purchase a power brick separately. Zeus cautions that you should not use a laptop or tablet charger. A proper one amp power brick is recommended, and I provided that link below this video. Once you power up your Zeus multi-relay, you're ready to pair it with your SmartThings hub. I invite you to visit my Bud's Smart Home website for complete instructions for connecting your Zeus multi-relay with your SmartThings hub. The SmartThings app will install four devices for the Zeus multi-relay. This includes the main Zeus multi-relay device, multi-relay 1, multi-relay 2, and multi-relay 3. Once these four devices are installed, you'll need to go to the device settings for the main Zeus multi-relay and update the switch type to garage door. Again, you'll find complete installation instructions on my website. When you complete the integration of the Zeus multi-relay into your SmartThings ecosystem, you gain the ability to automate your garage door opener within SmartThings routines. This will also give you the ability to auto-open your garage door on arrival 
and auto-close it on your departure. And best of all, you are ensuring that all smart devices are in one central app for integrated control and management. Hey, I trust you enjoyed this episode and found it of value. If so, please consider giving it a like. Thanks for joining me on today's episode. Until next time, keep automating and God bless.